I got a 2012 BMW 328i and um, I had a check engine light on. Um, the customer said that she went to a Jiffy Loop and got an oil change done and um, the check engine light came on. It was um, 2A85 and 2A87 or if you have the generic code reader, it'll tell you the P0015 and P0017, which is a uh, cam and um, um, intake camshaft and exhaust camshaft timing uh, codes. And so uh, I was leaning towards, uh, I should have known better, but I was leaning towards these, uh, the solenoids for uh, the vanos, uh, the exhaust and, um, and the intake. And um, I took them out there. They're pretty simple. They're right here in the front of the engine. There's uh, each of them are held by a 10 millimeter bolt. And it's just a simple connector with uh, a clip that you, you push, you press it and uh, it come and then you pull it out. So, uh, but, um, uh, so I, I, um, I bench tested these to supply battery voltage and they click, they don't look clogged, but usually sometimes they get clogged. Um, and, um, I did the resistant test on it. So it was measuring about 10.8. They were both the same. So I would assume that they're, uh, um, they're, uh, they're okay. And then, um, the other thing that I did, which I should have done before anything, I took off the oil, oil filter cap and it's missing the centerpiece. There's a little, um, you want to call it a shaft, I guess. There's a little piece that goes up and it's about this tall. And at the very end, there's an O-ring. The entire piece is missing. It, it, as you can see there, it clips right in the center there. And there's, there's nothing here. That little tiny hole that you see down there, that's where uh, um, the little tip goes with the O-ring. And that's what divides the oil going to the vanos. And uh, on these cars, there's a, there is a bulletin. If they do go bad, the dealers would usually change both of these, uh, these sensors or solenoids, and they would do a fresh oil change and they, um, they do an update on the ECM or the PCM and that takes care of everything. But in, in this case, um, uh, let's say again, 2012 has 70,000 miles and she went to a Jiffy Lube. So I guess this is what you get. So, uh, and they put the wrong oil, 5W40, should have been 530. So, um, yeah, just need another cap and uh, fresh oil change. And once I do that, I'll clear the codes and that should be it. Well, a lot cheaper than uh, changing these uh, solenoids. But again, they're, they're both working fine. So uh, we'll just leave it at that. But that is definitely the problem. Thank you and good luck.